Hey there, Kathy. Welcome to your monthly reading. So today we're taking a look at a lot of stuff for the month of December. And we're taking a look at a love, career, and things that you need to focus on, blocks that's happening, all that pretty good stuff. And keep in mind this is a general reading, so it's not going to resonate with everyone. If it doesn't resonate with you, you can always check your other signs. But if it does, definitely smash that like button and subscribe, comment. Anything that you can do to support this channel is very, very welcomed and appreciated, okay? When we're talking about love, rose could also be reversed. So always take what resonates, leave what doesn't, and let's see what we have here. So we have protection, nature signs balance acceptance and will and i'm kind of getting burnout kind of vibes it's and this protection in nature signs i do feel like your body is screaming screaming for you to rest it's screaming you for you to take care of your body for you to work out for you to drink a lot of water for you to drink um not to drink to eat healthy foods and it's like your mind is telling you, keep going, keep going, keep going. Balance, okay? I feel like your work, work life, love life, just life overall balance is kind of messy. And you may need to tune in those, those scales, okay? And it's, I feel like there may be some beliefs around career and around work that for you to actually be successful, for you to achieve all your goals you need to work 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 don't stop not sleeping not eating that is not true that is not true and your body is telling you that your body is telling you hey careful you're going down a rocky not so nice path okay when it comes to love we have here con in your soulmate and worth waiting for so honey you're manifesting, you are, and I do feel like it may take a little bit, and I kind of feel like it's more from your side, to be honest. It's not that this person doesn't have things to work on too, but I feel like it's more from your side for you to figure out that work life, um, that work, love life balance, and all that. But I also feel like, is that, is that an owl? Oh, wow. Um... And owls are the symbol of wisdom. And they're also the symbol of warning signs. I mean, I don't... There are coincidences, but an owl at this time of the day, right here at my door, while I'm doing this reading, Capricorn, you need to rest. You need to stop a little bit, okay? And chill <laughs> okay go out have fun i feel like you're so focused on career that you don't see anything else okay page of pentacles here overall energy with the ten of swords knight of pentacles it's really time to slow things down a little bit the knight of pentacles is a really slow night and i feel like you want to take move you want to move things super fast crazy and maybe you need to rest a little bit okay so Let's take a look here. Ooh, yeah, I mean, your work is paying off. Your current situation is the Ten of Pentacles, so it's actually looking quite good. But there's more to life than just work, 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 okay? Yeah, you're being a little bit... Um, I don't think it's necessarily being afraid. I feel like it's this is your block. This is the thing that maybe you should try and work a little bit on during this month, which is putting boundaries, not on people, on yourself, on work. Okay, putting a little bit a little boundary there. So maybe like spend more time with your family. If you can go back to your hometown to hometown to connect with your parents, okay? Call your siblings if you have siblings. That is a very specific message. But I feel like that is something that... Um, and the message, it's going to resonate for those of you who have been thinking about calling your family, calling your siblings, so calling your friends, but you always end up forgetting it or you're always ending putting it off, you know? Oh, I'll call them tomorrow. Oh, man, I didn't call them today. Okay, I'll call them in the weekend. And you never end up doing, okay? 
try to put that boundary there for work. It's like, okay, work, I hear you, but I also need time for myself. Okay, this is the message from your higher self with the fool here. It's like, take a look at the outside world. Take a look at all the other things that you have going on in your life and actually enjoy them. Actually work on them, okay? One thing that you have going on that is really going on on your favor, saving up. Okay, I do feel like you have been saving up a lot and you have made, a, if not necessarily saving up, but a lot of investment. And I actually feel like for those of you who this message is going to resonate, you have been worrying a little bit like, oh, maybe I'm spending too much money here and there and maybe I shouldn't. Maybe I should wait to put all these investments. It's, it's fine, okay? It's something that you're actually doing very work. If you have been investing on like those like stock market and stuff like that you may be getting a lot of return back so i feel like for a career is actually going to be a pretty good month but when it comes to love it's like mm. and you may feel like you're not putting enough energy on work you are okay let's actually start here with the four of cups you are But if there is something else, you see how that Ace of Cups is there. There is something else that you need to take a look at, okay? You're too focused on career. Look at love for a little bit, okay? You're very, very intuitive. And again, you're manifesting something new. Whatever you're trying to manifest, it is out there. It's already out there, okay? That new love that you want, that perfect partner, that husband, wife material, it's already out there. You've already asked for it here with the 90 cups okay and this i feel like it's not so necessarily for your person the person that you're about to connect about to deal with i feel like it's more for yourself this nine of cups she's having fun with herself she, she's having a party with herself i feel like that's a little bit of what you need it's a party with yourself and also i don't think that we discussed this world heart card here you may have possibly gone through a breakup recently and that's why your focus started to be so much uh work 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 okay this could have actually happened around october or something like that and you sort of left that behind you sort of okay i'm done with love no more love for me i'm done you know maybe it's time to get back into the game maybe it's time to open yourself up to people maybe okay so let me just clarify here a couple of things let me see the four of pentacles on things working in your favor yeah you're really good look at all these pentacles that is a lot of like material stuff and especially having the king of pentacles and the star and the nine of pentacles here you really know how to deal with your finances that is something very very good you really know what is um, safe to do, what is, where is safe to spend money, what is not safe to spend money, and where it's like, when to actually splurge a little bit, you know, you have that really good balance, so I really feel like your money situation is good, so let me see here, the nine of wands, yeah, man, <laughs> My God, look at all this. We have the King of Cups, which fell perfectly. I love when this happens. King of Cups, Ace of Cups, Temperance, Eight of Swords. There is a lot of blocked energy when it comes to your heart chakra to love. When it comes to you opening up to other people, maybe it's time to lift up those defenses. Okay, lift up those walls a little bit. Heal from whatever you need to heal when it comes to love, past life relationships, from this breakup, if that was the case. Maybe you've lost someone too. And, you know, give yourself some time to heal. That is why I also feel like it's important for you to breathe a little bit. For you to give yourself time to grieve. Even if it's not physical loss. Just give yourself time to breathe, to, to grieve, to heal. Okay? You really need to put up those walls when it comes to work. And to in for it affecting you the rest of your life, but also you lifting the walls from other people, from your family, from your friends. Okay, let me see these nine of cups. Have the queen of wands, and the page of swords. All right, so 
with this Queen of Wands and the Page of Swords here, if it's not uh, a fire sign that you're about to deal with, um, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, I had a little bug there, but they are definitely, it's like they are in the close circle around you. They may not be necessarily your friend, they may not know you necessarily, but they are definitely around you. So they, you may actually go to the same supermarket. You may actually know the same people or something like that. You may actually work on the same place or you may work with the same company, something like that, okay? They are around you and they are very fun to be around with. But you gotta be open to that energy. You gotta be open to having fun a little bit too, okay? So that is why I was getting that that thing that was making this a little bit delayed with the worth waiting for. Um, it it was from your side in the sense that you need to open up a little bit to the energy of having fun, to the energy of going out, to the energy of meeting new people, okay? Let me see the four of cups there. Wow. So we have the five of wands um, and the page of wands and also bottom of the deck. Look at this. The sun, but at the same time, your energy with the devil here. So it's like, I feel like perfectionism may be getting a little bit the best of you. You're getting a lot of inner turmoil with things that, oh, maybe this isn't perfect, maybe this isn't the right place, maybe this is not working out, maybe I should change this. You know, your whole mind is filled with work, and that also creates a little bit of inner turmoil, especially with other people. Maybe your family is saying, like, hey, I haven't seen you for a while, what is happening? Like, are you okay? And that is not totally healthy, okay? And also, don't be afraid to experience new things. You may be very focused on a specific solution for a problem. Maybe look not necessarily on another side, on another place, but try different things, okay? Let's see what we have here for you. Messages and advice for copy. Yeah, my goodness, a lot of self-worth, self-care cards here. So we have, you are in the right path, so stop for a second and have a bubble bath and face mask, take care of your body, drink freaking water, okay? Connect with your emotions, you're avoiding to do so, heal. Meditation, really try to lower that inner turmoil that is happening, really try to control it. And how can you do that? Take a little break from work, okay? Relax a little bit. You are doing, when it comes to work, everything is looking pretty damn amazing because that pentacle energy here is working in your favor. So there is nothing to worry when it comes to about, when it comes about um, money. Okay, but you really need to take a look at your body. You really need to take care of it. Okay, I feel like you're really at the edge of being burned out and you still have the opportunity during the month of December to cut it before you actually get to being burned out. Okay, so really take care of your body here, copy. So I hope this resonated. Hope it helps somehow. And I'll see you in the next one.